For decades, laser photocoagulation has been the mainstay treatment for diabetic macular edema and proliferative diabetic retinopathy. The identification of vascular endothelial growth factor as a significant element in the development of diabetic macular edema and proliferative diabetic retinopathy led to the creation of vascular endothelial growth factor inhibitory medicines. Ranibizumab was the first antivascular endothelial growth factor medicine to be licensed for the treatment of both diabetic macular edema and diabetic retinopathy in diabetic eyes. Ranibizumab has become a popular first-line treatment for diabetic macular edema. Emerging evidence suggests that it could be a valuable treatment for diabetic retinopathy and proliferative diabetic retinopathy. For diabetic Oh, very expensive. Ranibizumab is administered by injection into the affected eye by an eye surgeon. The frequency of injections and the duration of treatment depend on the specific condition being treated and the individual patient's response to the medication. As shown here in Kandy, Sri Lanka, consultant eye surgeon Dr. Mahinda Wirasekara administers ranibizumab to a patient with diabetic macular edema.